Okay, so let's talk about latitude and longitude. Um, where do we use latitude and longitude? We use latitude and longitude when we're looking at a globe. Why don't we use latitude and longitude very much when we're looking at a map? Got hills and mountains on maps. Does that have anything to do with latitude and longitude? So, no. No, not at all. The reason that we don't use latitude and longitude too often is because of a scale problem. Mm -hmm. This is called a seven and a half minute series topographic map, as is shown up in the top. That means that there's only a quarter of a degree of latitude and longitude from one side of the map to the other and from the top of the map to the bottom. So, if we want to find somewhere like your house, for example, or maybe this building, then we would want a grid system that works on a map this size. But if we're looking for a much more general area, like if we're looking for the location of Statesboro, or if we're looking for Hawaii, for example, something like that, then we want to use something that has a much larger scale on it, something that works well on a curved surface. Here we have a flat surface or we have a curved surface. So something that works well on a curved surface and something that has a much wider measurement. Latitude and longitude. So latitude and longitude, you are probably familiar with. Um, if you're not familiar with it, you've at least heard the words. So this um, globe has latitude and longitudinal lines on it. So which is which? Lucy, which one of these is latitude? The horizontal ones or the vertical ones? Horizontal. Horizontal is right. Which means that the vertical ones are longitude. Right? What is the zero degree line for latitude? That is the absolute center of the Earth, has one latitudinal line that runs around it. It has a special name, and what's that? Oh. Oh. Spit it out. Equator, Equator is right. That's what I thought. It's been a while. Equator is right. And what about longitude? Longitude has a zero degree line as well. Oh, I forgot this one. And it runs through Greenwich, England, dashed here on your globe as well. And what's the name of it, Emma? Prime Meridian. Prime Meridian is correct. I knew that one. Did you? All right, so these are where we start from when we start measuring latitude and longitude and start talking about how we locate places on the globe. So in the next video, we're gonna actually go through and locate several places using this globe.